So today's big question is a simple one. What happens if you take one fool, me, one humongous beanbag, and six vacuum cleaners? Oh, and space to play. Let's find out. Let's have a quick rundown of the six vacuum cleaners. In first place, we've got Abyssal Power Glide. Then we've got the Shark NV601 UK. You may have seen my reviews for this. Then the Sebo Felix, which I'm currently reviewing. A Hoover Hurricane Evo, a very small Hoover Sprint. And then a more recent purchase, as in yesterday, a McAllister Tub Vacuum. So let's see how they all fare up. First of all, let's get the beans out. It's gonna get messy. I may regret doing this. <laughs> Oops, it's like snow. Oh, it's getting in my slip flops. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's a lot. Ooh. Oh, I think. Oh, oh, this ain't gonna work. Right, okay, let's just chip that out of the way. <laughs> oh yeah, this is actually quite nice. Oh, oh god, I'm gonna be pulling these out of nooks and crannies for forever. Oh, in my hair and everything. The only question is, which vacuum do we use first? Woohoo! First one to get a go is the little Hoover Evo Sprint. Turn it on and see what happens. Bob has filled that tank up already. Yep. Well, that's that one full. Okay, next up. Let's try the Hurricane Evo by Hoover. I quite fancy doing this one through the pipe. Actually, it's been so long, I forgot I have to turn this one on. There it is. Right, I'm gonna empty that one out. I wanna look, <laughs> look at that, absolutely full. Let's chuck them back on the floor. Oh, look at the static electricity on that. Can you see it? <laughs> and they're all stuck in the filter. Oh, maybe this was a bad idea. Or maybe cyclone vacuums are just not good for hoovering up beanbag beans. Going to do right, okay. What I wanted to see was let's watch them all as they fill up into the stack. Full. Time for the Bissell Power Glide.
That was it, totally full. I'm still in the pipe. Right, let's empty this one out again. <laughs> That's fascinating. As I put my hands on, on the inside, it moves them away on the inside, which is really weird. Okay, that's as close as we're going to get it. Right, let's do this one again. I have to tell you what, let's try this one. Three down, three to go. Let's have a go with the shark. This was supposed to be a scientific test where I tested the capacity of each canister to see how much you could actually take. Maybe I'll do that later because this is just more fun. Turn it on. Put it in the canister already. I think that's full. And the question is, is, they're not stuck in the pipe, so they are still, oh yes, everywhere else. So this has filled up the whole canister on this one. Right, let's go. I think it's fair to say that that is absolutely full. This one, the SIBO, is going to be the interesting one simply because this one has a bag. Now this is a three litre canister and it's supposed to be bigger than all the others. However, that means that bag has to be completely full. And as you'll see in my upcoming videos about this machine, it does compact a lot into it. But I am curious, but once they're in that bag, I'm going to struggle to get them back out. And that means wasting a bag, possibly. There's only one way to find out. Let's give it a go! Let's turn it up. Warning indicator is on, and it's saying that this is full. Oh, and it's full. It's full, all right. <laughs> okay, so they're everywhere in the pipework and in the top of the housing. The bag isn't too bad. So they will. That's actually quite good fun. They do empty out of the bag quite nicely. I had a little boo-boo here because I have now actually got peens inside the, uh, the canister. So what I'm going to do is one more vacuum left. 
which is the McAllister wet dry pickle. Now this should take up 16 litres of these, and it will be the one that I end up using to clear this up ultimately. But what I'm going to do first is I am just going to use the long pipe just to get the ones that are the stragglers out of here. And do you know what, Cal? Helps if you turn it on at the wall. Right. Let's go! Have a look inside here. Do you to think? I really do. Are you ready? Oh my god, look at that! <laughs> There's no way that'd go back in there now. You'd have to empty it. <laughs> That's brilliant. How cool is that? In terms of sheer quantity, for collecting sheer quantity, this thing is superb. It was cheap as well. It's definitely going to take me months to wipe back him all this up. But I think it's about time I started. We've had our fun. Now it's time to clean up. <laughs> Oopsie.
I have to say, that could have been an awful lot worse. As it was, it was quite good fun. Catch you later, bye! There are still some left.